How's it going everyone? Haleem here from Village Food Tours. As always, thank you so much for watching. Today, I was invited out by my friends to Me Mexico Lindo. It's located in Merritt Island, Florida, right off of Courtney Parkway. So we've got a ton of stuff here and I'll just kind of go through it. So we've got um, Chili Rayant, we, if I said it right, but we've got that there. We've also got the Me Mexico Lindo fajitas right here. Red horchata. Um, I've also got one of these bad boys, one of these bad boys. And then, so we have the Me Mexico Lindo fajitas here. Then we've got an assortment. It looks like one of all of their tacos here got this awesome, lovely torta. Got some burrito tacos. You guys already know I love me some burrito tacos. We've got some rice and beans, which it actually looks in with a little guac and some of the vegetables there. I've got, for dessert, we have some flan. And then some churros as well, which comes with some ice cream and it looks like a strawberry sauce on there that looks just absolutely awesome. Okay, so the first thing, even though I'm not a sweet person, I'm gonna dig into is the flan. And I wanna give this one a shot. Now flan is, when done right, is one of my favorites. Get a little bite. Let's see, it comes off nice and clean, give it a shot. Oh, that was good. Sweet, creamy, thicker, not towards the like jello -y side. Really good flan, Ooh, really good. Now, to try the churros, which are one of my favorite, favorite things to get, but honestly, I've never had them authentically. It's always been at like fairs. Um, I haven't had the authentic Mexican churros, so, um, and Taco Bell doesn't count at all because that's not real Mexican food. Oh my god. Oh my god. So, I did not know they're stuffed with like a caramel, which is one of my favorites. I am all for happy surprises like this. Mm. And get a little bit there. Get a little churro. My ice cream. Oh my god. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. That's good. That is really good. Okay. Can't get too much into the dessert. Now I'm gonna go for some of the main stuff. I am. Gotta give myself some room because this is a ton of food. Absolute ton. I'm gonna try the red horchata. Kind of like a raspberry tea fruit punch almost, but much better than if you got one from like Lipton or somewhere. No. All right. So next, I'm gonna dig into, I don't know where I wanna start. There's so much good stuff. So let me go for the torta, cause that's big. Actually, no, I'm gonna go for the burrilla. Burrilla is where it's at. As you guys know, burrito tacos are one of my favorite types of tacos. I've done a bunch of videos on them. Links there below, down below, check it out. So, um, burrito, so basically how they make burrito tacos is they cook the beef down and create a consomme, a broth. And all that broth, um, when the tacos are cooking, <laughs> hey, how's it going? When the tacos are cooking, it creates this lovely, lovely juice. Um, kind of like a broth, but it's all the fat that kind of gets down. And then these are queso burrito tacos. So what they do is they dip the taco into the consomme. After that, they throw it on the flat top and then it gets a little sizzly, a little crispy because they are um, just flat corn tortillas. It's a little crispy and then they throw the meat on there, throw the cheese on there, sprinkle a little cilantro, sometimes onions, it just depends. And then once it's on there, um, they just kind of let it cook, quesadilla it, and then you have it and you've got the delicious 
consomme and you dip it and dunk it in. So we are going to dunk it like that into this delicious goodness of broth and you just see all that. It just looks awesome. Nice and oily, nice and fatty. Nothing probably healthy about it and if you don't like red meat it's probably not for you. But I am going to, ooh I'm crooked, but dipped. Mmm. Oh that's good. Mmm. Mm hmm so it does have the onions in it, I believe. Yep. Onions are nice and crisp. Um, tortilla is perfect. Nice little small shell. You got the beef, you got the cilantro, you got the onions. It all just blends perfectly well together. Combined with that, you dip it in the consomme. Absolutely just divine. Mm. Mm -hmm. Very good. Really good. Really good. So, and they use big chunks of beef, so it's not all the shredded beef. It's like, you know, we get some meat in there. Just look at how thick that is. Let me dig into the tacos. So now I'm going to, all right. So now this is, we're just going to go with just their regular tacos. So we've got an assortment here. It looks like we've got some pork, some steak, some chicken. Looks like a nice little assortment of it all. Okay. So, I think I've already had the beef with the burrito, so I think I'm gonna do the pork. It's got the radish on there. But one thing I always love, um, if I don't have any salsa, I'm gonna put, squeeze some lime on it. I love lime. I love the little sourness it gets. Let's get in. Mm. That was good. That was good. No way I could eat all the tacos. Next, I think I'm gonna try the fajitas because that's low carbs, easy to eat. Some cheese on top of it. Um, let's try, try, let's try some of the shrimp, Get a little bell pepper there, onions, I'm gonna try, let's get a little, tiny piece, I guess I'm gonna go all in. Typically, get the tortilla, throw the fajita in there, but we got plenty of food, obviously, so I'm not gonna <laughs> even mess with extra carbs right now. All right, so I tapped out on the fajitas. Next up is the chili relleno, which I don't think I've had one before, so I'm excited to try it. Looks like a stuffed pepper. some peas in there, all that good stuff. There we go, got the focus. All right. It's got some cheese in there, pepper, kind of red tomatoey sauce, um, and then the breading outside on the outside too has a distinct flavor. Oh, never had one of those before. Interesting. Not sure if I'm a fan. 
and it's not that it's bad at all it's just the flavor yeah, I'm not sure if that's something that's up my alley kind of got like a um, a gamey taste to it and then last but not least the torta so torta it's a Mexican sandwich and then they'll throw in the meat some sour cream guacamole just all that good stuff gets put in there there we go mm -hmm. I love sandwiches but it comes with a really thick bread mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. I wish I've been here about an hour watching them make all the awesome food I'm honestly really really full right now they amazing amazing what they did with all these dishes coming out here so um yeah all right guys so we just finished uh, eating all right guys so we just finished up eating at me mexico lindo here on merritt island florida we had a ton of awesome food we had some churros we had some flan we had a torta burrito tacos five different types of tacos chili relleno and a bunch of other stuff so um Super excited, super awesome people. Check them out. I'll leave the info in the comments below. Make sure if you like this content, hit that thumbs up button. Subscribe if you haven't, and we'll catch you next time.